If you flew a spaceship all the way to the edge of the universe, <laughs> what would you find? Okay, best we could tell, the universe does not have a wall like a reactor containment building. The observable universe has a limit, because light only had 13.8 billion years to reach us, but it could go on infinitely, or it could be finite but unbounded, kind of like the surface of a sphere in 3D space. But space itself is expanding faster than you could travel. Space might not actually end, but instead split into different universes. E a different reality. Okay, multiverse hypothesis. So there's the many worlds interpretation, there's inflation producing bubble universes, but both are theoretical. No experimental evidence yet. But even a nuclear powered spacecraft couldn't get to them without some new physics violates what we know about space time. You might find yourself back where you started, since space could actually exist in an infinite loop that curves <laughs> in every direction. Okay, so that would be a closed universe. General relativity does allow for this, but the universe's expansion rate, you wouldn't actually get there. It's possible that this is all just a simulation oh, created Lord. by a hyper-intelligent being. Hyper-intelligent. edge would expose the limits of the program, hitting a wall of code that you <laughs> All right, so hyperintelligent is a step beyond superintelligence, apparently. This is philosophy, not physics. We do simulations all the time in nuclear engineering, but you wouldn't detect it by reaching the edge. You would look for inconsistencies in the laws of physics. And no, there wouldn't be a literal wall of code. 